What's up ladies and gents, welcome back to Last Gaming, my name's Rob and this will be episode 49 of the Borderlands 2 fresh playthrough. So without any further ado, let's get into it. Okay, here we are. At the good old Arid's, uh, sorry, Arid, <coughs> Arid Nexus Badlands. Sorry about that. And uh, yeah, we got a good couple of things coming up. So uh, <clears throat> let's check that we got half decent weapons. Yeah, all right, there's a vendor coming up, so. Mm, we'll use this. Right, so, yeah, we got to go up here. Be a couple of skags just over this hill. Yeah. Okay. Nicely done. Let's, uh... There's some ammo from there. There's a few more skags. Let's just check these. Information, yeah. security footage, it all flows to the stockade. Get inside. A few more skags down here. Good news, everybody. I stole the drop large. Alperian was no match for my secret. Punch you in the face until you die, fighting style. When the time comes, you know that we'll fight our way to easily the taken care of. Hi. Around here, we're going to have a couple of loaders. Thank God we got the corrosive uh, SMG. Mm. The sunlight's not great on this because making it a little bit hard to see, but never mind. Okay, so, as you can see, this little area here has a uh, electrified force field on it, whatever you want to call it. Now, to turn that off, I'll switch to a sniper. You can see up there it says electrical fuse box. Just shoot that. Fuse box off. Field gone. So you can now have access to this uh, health vendor. Any decent shields? Yep. Uh, let's just compare that to mine. Okay. I'm going to take that, put it on. Oh, let's use that badass so good. What do we need? Local hit damage. Lovely. Uh, yeah. Let's get rid of that. Hmm. And which one was it? Okay. Mark that up. Sell some stuff. It's actually a decent pistol. I might come in handy very soon. Watch that also, we'll get rid of that. Let's fire. Okay. Next time you're bleeding to death, just see what's in here. That's 266, and this one's 350. Okay. I'm not really a fan of Dahl. I've mentioned in previous uh, episodes, and I much prefer Hyperion. But you just can't argue with that much more damage. So. We'll keep that one and get rid of the uh, Hyperion one. Right, a couple of little secrets around this area before we go and tackle uh, one of the uh, the bosses. You come up over here. Oh, there's a ammo vendor here, as you can see. Help you kill many 
I did sell everything, I'm not sure yet, okay. We'll so, if you come up over here, you might recognise this. If you played the first Borderlands, you might recognise this area. This is where we meet Dr. Z in that room over there. Where we first get a vehicle over there. If you come over here, jump up on there, jump up on And then jump up to this thing over here. You can see Clappy. Get badass points for that. Badass, uh, like badass points even. Hmm. And a little chest. Okay. And then, if you remember, round the back here, although in the first portal, and you went that way and come round this way. You find Bonehead, except in this one, you've got Bonehead 2.0. And yeah, these things are a lot easier to kill. Now, in this one, in the, uh, sorry, in the first Borderlands, he had a chance to drop his gun, the Bone Shredder. And he has a chance to drop that in this one. Although, I've got to be honest, it is quite rare that I get it. But there's a chest in here anyway, so we'll have a quick look in there. Right. I'll take it to sell it. Okay, on with the mission. So you can come out this way now. And there'll be a few more loaders out the back. Over there. Oh, look, you can see one of them standing over there. Success. Come on, pick that up. Excellent. Okay, so. Push up here a little bit. I don't know if a couple more loaders come up by here or if that was all of them. No, I think that might have been it. Now you want to be careful here, ladies and gents, because if you go too far, you will activate Saturn. Saturn will fall out the sky and land up on that bridge over there. But you can come as far up to here and not activate him. And in the higher levels, you have a chance to get a loot midget out of these boxes around here. Um, there's a little skag here, we can just go ahead and kill him. Now in the first Borderlands there was a, uh, a challenge for doing... getting up on this roof. There's a red box there. Just pistols, look. Let's go ahead, put that on. And um, this one's better. Okay. Okay. Right, we're going to activate um, Saturn now. And let him come down. And try and finish him off. There you go. You can hear him coming in. So we'll go ahead, give him a couple of phase locks. If ever you need to get into cover, ladies and gents, head back here. To where these two boxes are. You just hide up against this corrugated sheet here. But he's pretty much done. There you go. I knew this pistol would come in handy. As I said, the uh, the boxes around here, the loot crates, they have a chance to uh, have a um, uh, <coughs> a loot midget jump out of them. Maybe not on the first playthrough, but definitely on the second or third, there's a higher chance. Okay. So I think all his loot landed on the bridge up there. 
except for that. And maybe this is that was just money, yep. Okay. Now what we're gonna do, because we got the cat class mod on, we're gonna switch back to our SMG. Because there's gonna be a few more enemies up top now. was and there was money. Oh well. Right. Also there's um six ammo boxes up here. So might as well take advantage of them. Go. And then you just work your way along this road bridge, whatever you want to call it. Yeah I know you think I'm a monster you think I enslaved See what? He's dropped. Another Vladov pistol. It's funny seeing as I killed him with a Vladov pistol. I had to. And I'm sure he had to explode. Mm, he's not dropped much. Power too. Don't listen, Vault Hunter. He does have a chance to drop a uh, a rocket launcher called the Hive, which is daughter. decent. <laughs> well, I know he doesn't well, drop it often. <laughs> As it turns out, a so yeah, we can get more loaders here. RPG loaders. They've got to be the worst in the game, I think. And now we should get a badass construct about here. Go ahead, get some testers down. Got them for ya. There we go. Hello, Bree. I'll be leveled up. Beautiful. More iridium, up to 35 of that now, that's good. Right, and then over here you're gonna get some invisible engineers come down. So get a grenade out. Go. Great job, amigo. Now that you're in, there There's a lot of um Find it. loot boxes and crates around here, ladies and gents, so make sure you you're checking everywhere you can. Go, get some more ammo. Nicely done. You go up the ladder here. Uh, ladder, sorry, stairs. A little bit more ammo. Uh, nothing from there. Okay, that's good. Right, so we're gonna get some loaders and whatever you come in here. Thankfully, we're a corrosive master, so. RPG loaders, very annoying. Okay. One more, there's an RPG as well. Would be, wouldn't it? Okay, so, take this opportunity now just to check, no, we need anything from here, cash, it's a good couple of ones around the corner here, pistols, my god this game loves giving us pistols. I think I'm up to sell them, nope, we're full. Never mind. We'll have to check because uh, up here, ladies and gents, there is another. Uh, gun crates. So, uh, I'll tell you what. Probably gonna have a gritty pistol here somewhere. Yeah. Oh. Let's just take that. And uh, another grey one. They're gonna be. Oh. They're gonna be the least valuable. 
Okay. Pop your thing in there, and then it finds out where the warrior is. There! Jack sent all the Iridium he's mine straight to the Hero's Pass. That must be where the warrior's buried. Get back to Sanctuary. It's time to get ready for the final assault. Okay, so then you take this. And now we're going to get two constructors as soon as you step out here. Huh. One button, get a grenade out. One done. There you go. Nicely done. Hmm. Alright, we're gonna have to drop another thing because I'm pretty sure that's better than my fire. SMG. Oh yeah, so it was just drop the fire SMG. Mm-mm. -mm. And then what you want to do, ladies and gents, move her off the end here. Back down to where we fought the Skag earlier. Oh, come on, get up on there. And then we can just fast travel back to Sanctuary. Just make sure... Oh, I'm still blocked, okay. So we can just pop over here now, quickly turn this in. That'll be the end of this episode. Just check. Yeah, we know, you might get lucky with the iridium. Oh yeah, first things first, so we're nice and fresh for the next episode. You can never Go ahead and sell... Oh, I don't want that fire burst. Okay. I don't know, I've still got the shotgun. There you go. Okay. Let's turn this in, and then we're done. Ah, uh, there he is. Okay, I thought so. We're going to pick up this mission. Before we turn in debt mining. Newscast to say you're killing kids and kicking puppies? I found the guy who's recording them. He's in the arid nexus. Pay him a visit and set the record straight. Let's get there. So we gotta find the radio station, that's the radio station there, ladies and gents. This is pretty simple this uh this mission. And it can give you a good reward. So we gotta go and kill a guy now called Hunter Hellquest. Or Hellquest, sorry. And he has the possibility to drop the legendary shield, the B shield. Which is an amp drain shield. Except it does no amp drain. It gives you loads of extra damage on your weapons. It doesn't take anything off your shield. So anyway. Let's give him a phase lock. Get him with a cloud kill. Finish him off. There you go. He hasn't dropped the, uh, the B-Shield. As you can see, there's no legendary. Let's just check that. 
shotgun. No, mine is still more powerful. Okay, then we've got to turn it in. We can do that with data mining, so... They've buggered off down there, so yeah. Let's we'll just go down here. Move it back over to uh, the fast travel. I will see you back in Sanctuary. Let's turn both of these in now then. And then we can call it a day. <laughs> Is he in the same place? Or has he moved? No, he's moved. Now oh, he's over here. Let's do this just in first, yeah? Good on you. Things should be a lot easier for us without that windbag spouting lies every day. Doesn't matter, they're both the same amount. Jack, Lilith, and the warrior are in Hero's Pass. So there you go. This is the final fight, amigo. You gotta prepare, do it now. Right, so that's going to be the end of the episode, ladies and gents. As always, if you enjoyed it, please leave a like. If you have any uh, questions, suggestions, leave a comment. We've been having some really good comments lately, so, you know, we appreciate those. And as always, if you haven't already, please, please, please subscribe. Uh, we're getting close to 200 subscribers now. Uh, and if you do subscribe, hit that bell icon, and it will keep you up to date with all the latest SS Gaming videos. Uh, until next time... Take care. Bye.